Hi. <laughs> Story today with Miss Annabelle and maybe Miss <laughs> Madison. <laughs> No. There's Alex. Oh. <laughs> ah. Emily. Susie. And Penelope. Mm -hmm. Back to school. Cool. My Susie's back. It was the first day of school. Yes, here we are. Now I look like a second grader, Susie Duckin said proudly. She's looking in the mirror. Susie walked to school with her best friend, Emily Marmot. Red, blue, or purple hair bow, said Emily. What do you think? I think you're driving me crazy, Susie giggled. <laughs> yeah, there's Emily Marmot. She's trying to decide which bow, red, blue, or purple. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Um, purple. You think purple? Purple's a good choice. <coughs> Zip! Jack Quacker flew past them on a skateboard. Woohoo! He shouted. Second grader coming through. Look! Look out! Susie called. There's Jack Quacker. Zoop! There's Susie going, hey, look out! Uh oh. Jack whipped past a girl. Oh no, said Susie. That's my new neighbor, Penelope O'Quinn. Are you okay, Penelope, she called. Wow, he really knocked her down, poor girl. <laughs> oh look, her lunch is just flying everywhere. Ah, oh, she's even got a leaf cutting her quill. Oh wait, it was already there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I used to have some shoes just like that. I am all right, Penelope said. Her voice was very soft. Emily helped Penelope pick up her lunch. What an interesting lunch, thought Susie. Olives, tuna Mommy, and marshmallow sandwich, down. and a green banana. Look, <gasps> we have mm -hmm. olives, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. olives and a tuna sandwich and a green banana. Mm -hmm. Daddy eats green bananas. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. You too? Because well, they have green bananas in the Philippines, but they're a little bit different than our green bananas. There they are talking. Want to walk to school with us? Susie asked. That would be nice, said Penelope. That would be great, she thought. She didn't know many Duckport kids yet. I can't wait to meet our new teacher, Susie said. You're making friends. Oh my goodness, thanks for the pillow. Do we need more pillows on the couch? Um, yeah. Mm. Either dude. <laughs> I brought her something, Penelope said shyly. See? She got a little nice little plant for her teacher. That's a nice gift. Oh, oh my goodness, we're gonna see this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what are you doing, huh? <laughs> It sure is thorny, Emily noted. Thank you, said Penelope. I wanted to get her something no one else would. At the schoolyard, the girls joined a jump rope game. Let's do the bubblegum song, called Susie. Suddenly, a voice boomed. Oh, wow, look at that. Bubblegum, bubblegum in a dish. How many pieces do you wish? One, two, three, four, five, six. Windows rattled, traffic stopped. Penelope sure was full of surprises. Oh, her little, she was so shy and quiet before, and then she's just so loud. I guess she was really confident. She knew this one. <laughs> Everybody's like, wow, who's a new girl? <laughs> what if our new teacher will be funny, said Jack. <laughs> I wonder if she's strict, said Corky Turtle. <laughs> Corky. Yeah, Corky. <laughs> I wonder why she's not here yet, said Susie. Baby turtle. Yeah, he's a baby turtle. He's a little turtle. He's a kid. Oh. Yeah, like Penelope's trying to peek through the window. Mm -hmm. Oh, the ostrich. A bice. She's from Africa. Oh, is she? Yeah, ostriches Mommy. are from Africa. 
really? How interesting. No one. <laughs> You're gonna let me read. Yes, she's an ostrich. She's riding a bicycle. Look at that. <laughs> he has a shiny blue helmet. Oh yeah. Very cool. That's because it's queen. Oh, you think so? <laughs> it's just a design. Maybe. Ring! A bicycle bell ring behind them. Sorry I'm late, the teacher sang out. I stopped for donuts. Nothing kicks off the school year. Like a good crueler, I always say. <laughs> ring, ring. Oh, look at all those donuts. Yummy. I like donuts. <laughs> I like donuts too. You do? I bet you do. <laughs> Don't we all? Please. Oh. <laughs> Please. I am Miss Cornelia Oakloom, she announced. But if you like, you may call me Miss O. Hmm, I think they like her already. <laughs> and you're walking to the classroom. Look, Annabelle. Yeah, Alex? Yeah. Look what's in the classroom. She's got, is that a bubble gum machine? Yeah. Ooh. And look, the little leaf <coughs> rubbings or something. That looks really nice. Oh, and there's the so, plant from Penelope. It's a wee Mommy, wee that. It's yeah, a wee that's her feathers. It's a wee it says feathers. Oh, oh. A leafing rubbing. Yeah. <laughs> and oh, look there's at this donut box. tower. Yeah, there's the donut box. Yum, here. And there's a tower, yeah, a leaning tower. And there's tower. crackers. So, Cause they're gonna make a city out of snack crackers. Oh yeah? It's the leaning tower of pizza. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's got a trophy. No, no, no. With a little bell on the top. She's got a trophy on the little bell. The trophy reminds me of my medal that I got. Oh, yeah. Maddie got it. her first medal for soccer. It's awesome. And lots of colors and things. Scissors, paper, colorful paper. Looks like it's going to be a fun classroom. Second grade is going to be awesome. <laughs> Miss O pulled some very odd things out of her bag. Well, boys and girls, she began, we have a very exciting uh, year ahead of us. We're going to keep journals, we're going to work with fractions, and we're even going to build a city out of snack crackers. Hmm, how did you know that? <laughs> I remember. <laughs> we love this story. We love Susie's. Oh, Susie's fractions? stories. That's math. Yeah. And kind of geometry, too. Yeah? It's definitely down your alley. Let's see. Hey, hey, toes. <laughs> hey, all right. All right, so we have Miss O over here and in front of the class. And here's all the kids eating their donuts. Yum, 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 yum. Delicious. Sometimes, Miss O Plume said, we will stand on our heads. But mostly, we're going to have fun. Now it's your turn, Susie Duckin. Would you please tell us about yourself? <gasps> Miss O asked. Cer Certainly, Miss O Plume, said Susie. Folks always notice Susie's good manners. Miss O did too. <laughs> Susie told about her rock collection. Then Jack showed his latest skateboard moves. Mm. <laughs> Corky. Corky said that he liked maps. He liked Miss O's globe earrings. That means he likes geography. Geography? Yeah. Mm. Emily skipped her turn. She was busy handing out napkins. Donuts can be so messy, she said. <laughs> finally, finally it was Penelope's turn. My favorite color is brown because it goes with me. She began, and my favorite snack is stuffed olives because I like food that looks you in the eye. <laughs> Look like eyeballs. And I like being a porcupine because I can put stuff on my quills. <laughs> Look at that. She's got donut in her quills and olives. Oh my goodness. Her classmates laugh. They like this new kid. <laughs> Hmm, got bags of leaves, lots of colors and glue, markers. Time for art, announced Miss O. You'll be in three groups. I would like you to create your very own leaf art. Think of expressing the beauty of the season in a whole new way. No idea is a bad idea. Here they are, hard at work. They're talking about their ideas over here. And, oh, they're getting some ideas over here. Oh, 
they're gonna do. <laughs> Let's think of something really cool, Susie said to her friends. Let's wait and see what everybody else is doing, said Jack. Emily scowled. That's a bad idea. Miss O said there's no bad idea, said Jack. Trust me, said Susie. Co copying is always a bad idea. You said co copying. <laughs> co <-pi> <laughs> copying. No, you said co copying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, my bad. I know what we could make, Penelope said softly. She told everyone her plan. I wonder what it's going to be. Oh, all the groups were hard at work. Finally, Miss O called out. Finish up, kids. It's showtime. Yes. Yes. Vivian Snortwood's yes. group went first. Yes. We put the leaves under the paper, said Vivian. And then we rubbed crayons on the top. Very nice, Miss O said. I love the colors. <laughs> the next group unrolled their paper. The trees on their pictures picture were covered with real leaves. I like the way you use those leaves, said Miss O. Plume. Next group. Susie and her friends made a pile of leaves in the middle of the floor. All was quiet. And Penelope called. I give you fall. Jack turned on the fan. Oh! <gasps> Wow, the leaves swirled all around. It was like being outside on a windy day. The children in Miss O clapped and clapped. <laughs> Bravo, Miss, uh, said Miss O. <laughs> Living art, how wonderful. Shh. Yeah, yeah, wow. And feels like... Oh no, oh. they're getting all in his face. <laughs> He's getting some on See, his. And they're all just landing on her. Yeah, like. On her quills. All over her quills. How funny. Wow. Oh, I was like, wow, that's so much fun. <laughs> that's really cool. That was a really neat idea. <laughs> second grade. Yeah, second grade. Your idea was really different, Jack told Penelope, but it turned out great. Penelope's ideas are different, said Susie, and that's what we like about her. But that was a good story. And there is Miss Susie. <laughs> Susie's back. Doo -doo -doo. How do you say it, Monty? Doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Ta da! Ta da for now! <laughs> Can you say bye bye?